What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If you are here for the live stream premiere, welcome. I'm excited to be chatting with you guys. In today's video, we are going to be checking out Halsey's new song, Graveyard. This looks like a video with a time lapse. Um, from what I saw on Twitter, if I'm connecting the dots correctly, um, this was her painting the album cover for her new album, which is coming out, which we are obviously all excited to be checking out. Now you guys know I don't know a ton of music from Halsey. I checked out some of her live lounge stuff. And I also really loved the song Nightmare. I feel like I listen to it a few times a day at this point. If you follow me on Spotify, which if you don't already, the link is in the description, you'll see that I have that song playing at some point during every single day. Uh, I just, I love everything about it. I love the live lounge se session of it. I just, I'm into it. That's, I don't know what else to say. I'm into it. So I'm excited to check out Graveyard. Don't know what the sound's gonna be like, and I really don't have a sound to judge based on Halsey because I just don't know enough of her music. We're gonna get into this. If you like videos like this, don't forget to like, subscribe. All right, let's do it. It's crazy when the thing you love the most is the detriment. And let that sink in. Can think again. And the hand you wanna hold is a weapon in. And nothing but skin. Oh, cause I keep digging myself down deeper I won't stop till I get where you are I keep running, I keep running, I keep running They say I may be making a mistake I would have followed all the way no matter how far I know when you go down all your darkest roads I would have followed Okay. I love that right there, where the instruments break down. I love that line right there. It's funny how the warning signs can feel like butterflies. It's funny how the warning signs can feel like the butterflies. Oh, the way she said it too. Uh, well, I'm just we, out of the way really quick. I didn't realize that Halsey was an artist, and I didn't realize she was such a great artist at that. This album cover right here that she did is absolutely beautiful. I really hope that it is what they used. I'm pretty sure it is because of the tweet that I saw, but this is just really great. So take away the song in general. It's just amazing to watch her paint that, to paint herself in such a beautiful way. The lettering she did on Halsey right there, I just became an art review channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about Halsey's art. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I like this song. 
So I've only heard a few songs at this point. Um, I'm trying to get to a point in my in my YouTube career where I can stop saying that, where I can just say like, okay, now that we've listened to Halsey's back catalog, but of course there's a lot of videos to make in the process. But this is definitely, um, instrumentally, it has a little bit more of a pop, like a radio pop sound than I've heard from her in the past. Um, and I say that because there's like the series of like, either like snaps or claps or whatever that, that sometimes you, those are the beats that become most popular and get played on the radio the most. So that's why I say that. Um, and same with like the verses and the hook. And I'm okay with that. I want that for Halsey because every album, in my opinion, needs a hit like that. Um, look at other artists like Lana with Summertime Sadness. Look at um, Taylor with like You Need to Calm Down or Me. There, there are songs that just are really great to play for everyone and to get everyone interested. And then you get them into the album and that's where you can really pour your heart out. And I feel like that is definitely the song. I will say that even though I felt like that was kind of the vibe, once we got to that end part where she said like, it's funny how the warning signs can feel like butterflies, uh, Halsey snapped right there. And I'm not just saying that with Stan Twitter lingo. I mean like she actually snapped. You can hear her say like, like butterflies and she got like angry for a second and then it kind of ended and I love that because it makes me wonder what the rest of the album is going to sound like. I love when a single comes out like this that sort of leaves you guessing, right? Because we don't quite know what the sound is going to be and so we get a single like this and it's kind of like, okay, wow, this is a real radio friendly bop. What's next? So. I feel like you guys are gonna want me to do the Halsey album and I wanna do it because I really, even with only a handful of songs I've listened to, God, I can't wait to stop saying that. Um, it's, I've already sort of like created how I feel about Halsey and it's obviously all positive. I wanna learn a lot more about her. I want to listen to more music from her. Um, and you guys are gonna want me to do her other albums before I get to this one. Is this H3? I'm gonna guess this is her third release. I have two other albums I need to check out. So. If you guys are here for the live stream, let me know in the chat. But if you are here to watch the video, let me know in the comment section. Are you guys interested in me doing some of Halsey's albums? It's something that I'm very interested in. Um, if not, obviously I just listen to them on my own. But if you guys are interested, then I will watch them on the channel with you guys. So let me know. Hope you guys liked today's video. If you did, please make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, follow me on Twitter. Thank you guys so much for your support. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.